Hello boys and girls! Today we are going to learn about hard and soft materials. Things that are hard and things that are soft. And what does hard mean? Here we have a hammer. Yes? A hammer is a hard object. Yes? Because hard objects, hard materials, cannot be easily cut. Yes? Cut. If I try to cut this hammer, yes? It's very hard. Yes? If I try to cut the iron, yes, or the wood, it's very hard. Or bent as well, really hard to bend. Or here we have a piece of cotton, yes, some cotton. Cotton is a soft material. Why? Because it can be easily bent, yes, you can see, can be easily bent and stretch as well. And if I stretch it, stretch it, stretch it, Look what happens, yes? Okay, now it's time to classify those materials into hard and soft, okay? I'm going to get the first object, yes? What is it? Who can remember the name? A sponge, exactly, a sponge. Look what I'm doing with this sponge, okay? I can bend it, twist it, yes? and twist. I can really scratch it. Yes, it's very difficult to scratch it. And if I get a pair of scissors, yes, I'm not going to cut it though. I'm sure, yes, I could cut it. Yes, I'm not going to cut it, but you can cut the sponge. Yes, is it hard or soft? Mm, well done everybody, it's a soft material, it's not hard. Another trick that I'm going to give you is, if you bang the object against the table or the wall or the floor, yes, you can hear a loud sound, a loud bang. Let's see if we can hear it with the sponge. Not really. Yes, yeah, so that means it's soft. Right, next material. We have this stone. I'm going to try to bend it, but it's very, very difficult. Yes, it's very difficult to bend the stone, yes. And I don't think I can cut this with the scissors, yes. Yes, it's very difficult to cut. And also, if I bang it, ooh, my ears, you can hear a loud bang, bang, bang. Is it a hard material or soft? Well done. Yes, it's hard. Yes, it's a hard material. Is it hard? Okay, next one. What about a t-shirt? Yes, we've got a t-shirt. Hmm, I can stretch it a little bit. Yes, I can stretch it a little bit. It can be bent. Yes, it's not like the stone. It can be bent. And let's see what happens if I bang it on the table. Nothing, isn't it? You can't really hear anything. It's not a loud bang. Yes? And what happens if I scratch it? Nothing. Is it a hard or a soft object? I will give you five, four, three, two, one. It's soft. Well done. It's a soft material. Yes? Soft. Okay, next one. I'm gonna get a piece of wood, yes? It's kind of like twig stick, yes? Right, I'm gonna try to bend. I'm not really strong. Yes, it's a hard or soft material. Is it easy to bend? Is it easy to twist? Yes, do you think if I use my scissors, I can cut? little pieces 
Right? Question. Hard or soft? Yes, it's hard, yes? Listen. If I bang it as well, is you can hear a loud bang, okay? Hard. Next thing. What happens with this teddy bear, yes? This kind of like soft toy, yes? I can easily, poor little toy, I can easily, yes, bend, yes, look at this, I can bend it, I can twist it, I don't want to break it though, yes, I love this teddy so much, I could, I'm sure, yes, I'm not going to do it, I could cut as well, yes, but don't do these things, yes, so, and if I bang it, sorry Teddy, can you hear anything? No. So, hard or soft? It's soft. Exactly, it's a soft object. Thank you Teddy. Then, we have this hammer. We saw it before. The hammer, yes, we need to be careful with this object because, yes, if we bang it, yes, we use it actually, yes, for nails, yes, for nails, to hang up like frames, yes, and pictures, yes, if we bang it, you can hear a loud sound. Right, so then, is it hard or soft? Hammer, we said it before, yes, it's a hard object, okay. We have the cotton, yes, we saw it before, and we said that it was soft, okay? Soft. Then we've got this jar, yes? It's made out of glass, yes? The glass, okay, glass, if we bang it, you can hear a loud sound, okay? And it's very difficult to bend or twist, yes? We need to be careful with the glass because if we drop it, it breaks, yeah, it will break. But actually, it's not a soft material, yes? It's not like a t-shirt where you can squeeze it, twist it, yeah, or the sponge, yes? The glass, it's hard, isn't it? Hard material, hard object. What happens with the kitchen wallpaper, yes? We can twist it, yes, we can bend it, we can make a ball, it's like plasticine, yes. And if I want to cut it, I will cut this one, yes, if we want to cut it, we can, yes, it's very easy. And if I bang it, no, we can hear anything. So is it hard or soft? Mm -mm -mm. It's soft, it's a soft material, yes? And we've got felt here, yes? Similar to the kitchen paper, yes? We can twist it, bend it. If I bang it, I can't hear anything, yes? And if I cut, yes, I'm gonna cut just a little bit. If I cut it, yeah, it's very easy to cut. So, is it hard or soft? Hard or soft? Yes, it's soft, boys and girls. And then, yes, it's this, it's like the wood, isn't it? Yes, it's easy to scratch if I use something hard enough to scratch. Yes, it's very difficult to bend. If I bend it too much, if I if, if I were very strong, I could break it, yes? But it's not easy to do it, okay? And if I bang it, we can hear a sound, yes? A loud sound. So, is it hard or soft? It's hard, that's it, it's hard. Okay, so I would like you now to get some hard and soft objects from your house, yes, and send us some pictures, yes, classifying them, yes, into hard and soft materials. 
okay? Right, boys and girls, I hope now you know what a hard object is, the hard properties of the materials, and soft, okay? See you soon. Bye.